Hello, class of 2024. Welcome to Deer Valley High School. Welcome to our parents as well. My name is Dr. Everybody. I'm Deer Valley High School's principal, and I am excited to welcome you. I know that this is not a traditional year, and we have not met each other, but I certainly look forward to meeting you sometime soon. This video and this webinar will provide you an opportunity to get information on how to access resources and how to get to know your teachers and the opportunities we have available here at Deer Valley High School. Once again, I don't want to take up all the time, but I want to walk you to Deer Valley High School. Be sure to visit our webpage, our Facebook page, our district webpage, and Deer Valley's webpage for a link to resources for students and our parents as well. Thank you and welcome to Deer Valley High School. freshman class of 2024. My name is Miss Woodall and I am one of the counselors at Deer Valley High School and I'm so excited that you are starting your high school career off with us at Deer Valley. This year I will be the counselor for students with the last name GR through PA so that means if your last name is Grant or Graham or Green that GR at the beginning I am your counselor all the way through last names PA. So I can't wait to work with you and meet you. Um, even if we're doing that virtually, there's so many great ways for us to connect. So check out our school counseling website for all of our information, how to email us, how to call us, how to text us, um, and we will get started soon. So have a great first week of school and we can't wait to meet you. Welcome freshman class of 2024. I am so excited that you're starting your high school journey here at Deer Valley. I'm one of the counselors here. My name is Miss Lee and I have last names P-E through Z. So if your last name is Peters or your last name is Zebra or anywhere in between, I'll be your counselor. I know that this is probably not how you imagined to start your high school journey, but I'm still really excited for everything that this year is going to bring, and I know it's going to be a great year. 
whenever you get a chance, make sure you check out the counseling website. Um, there's a ton of good information on there. Uh, you can also reach out to me at any time if you need anything. All of my information is on there. Um, I really hope that you guys have an amazing first week of school and an amazing school year. Please reach out if there's anything that you need. And welcome, freshmen, class of 2024. I'm so excited to meet you. Hello freshmen, my name is Brian Coppert. I'm the lead teacher of the Deer Valley High School Law Academy. Uh, we have a lot of great programs in the Law Academy from mock trial to model United Nations and field trips uh, all over the place. And we look forward to meeting you guys in person and providing those opportunities as soon as we get back to normal. Hi, my name is Jeff Adkins. I'm the lead teacher for ACE Academy. Uh, welcome to Deer Valley High School and welcome to ACE Academy. Um, as a freshman you may have questions about which pathway you should have signed up for. You can change your mind uh, later so if there's a problem don't worry about it. But the uh, pathways that you have are uh, robotics, biomedical, uh, visual art, uh, child development, and general studies. General studies is what you should pick if you don't know what else to pick. It allows you to design your own custom academy pathway. Um, if you have questions, go to our website at www.dvaceacademy.com and get in touch with me. I'll be getting in touch with you this fall through Remind and Microsoft Teams. Welcome to Deer Valley and I hope you have a good uh, beginning of your freshman year. Hello freshmen! Welcome to Deer Valley. I'm Ms. Thrift and I'm in the Deer Valley Academy of the Performing Arts or DEVAPA for short. DeVapa is home to all the performing artists, like singers, and dancers, and actors, and musicians. Plus, we have technical theater classes where you learn all those ins and outs of the backstage theater. In DeVapa, you can immerse yourself in the performing arts, or you could just take a class or two. Whatever you need, we're here to turn on your creative side. So come join us in Devapa, where ordinary moments become extraordinary experiences. Hey, Deer Valley Class of 2024. I'd like to welcome you to a new school year. My name is Mr. Hanna. I am the freshman English teacher for the Business Academy. I also teach our marketing class and coach our baseball team. This year as freshmen, you can plan to be challenged more than you've been challenged in the past. We are going to read two novels, one of which is Of Mice and Men. We'll read lots of short stories. We'll do some poetry. We'll read a Shakespearean tragedy called Romeo and Juliet. And we'll probably also do some Greek mythology. We hope you have a great school year and we look forward to the first day. Hi, this is Mr. Corning from the Science Department. Two to four years of science fulfill your area D requirement for college entrance. Science tries to explain how the world works through hypothesis testing. Courses include biology, chemistry, physics, astronomy, marine science, and the biomedical and robotics classes. This year you'll probably be taking biology. I hope you will learn about things like how disease limits population size in the ecology unit, and how viruses attack cells in the structure and function unit. By the end of the year, you should have a better understanding of why I'm recording this in my kitchen rather than my classroom. Hey class of 2024, I'm Coach Tilson. I'm the department chair for the PE department as well as the varsity softball head coach. I just want to take this opportunity to welcome you to the Wolverine family. I also want to say good luck as you embark on this new adventure called high school. I hope that you enjoy the great classes and all the fun activities we offer here at Deer Valley. I look forward to meeting you once we start up our fall classes. Again, welcome, good luck, and go Wolverines. Buenos dias, bonjour, konnichiwa. Welcome to the freshmen of 2020 from the World Language Department here at Deer Valley High School. At our school, you can take up to four years of French, of Spanish, or of Japanese. If you stick in it for all four years and get B's, you automatically get the biliteracy seal on your diploma. A word of advice for a foreign language especially, just come to class every day, pay attention and participate, and you'll do fine. Hasta luego. Abiento. Sayonara. Hey, freshman, what's up? 
My name is Mr. Olf, and I am the head of the CTE department, the Career Tech Education Department here at Deer Valley High School. Really excited to have you guys. Um, I know it's a weird year, but hopefully we can work our way through it together. Um, this year, the only class that you probably have um, in a career tech standpoint is um, health, which is part of the career tech uh, umbrella, right? You'll be exploring different careers and uh, things that you might want to explore over the next coming four years. Uh, moving forward, you've got plenty of classes to choose from. You've got uh, web design and uh, digital tools with Mr. Groib. You've got video production with me. You've got a uh, marketing class. You've got cooking class with Mr. Feriosi, Chef Paul. And you've got uh, careers with children with uh, Miss Marples where you can uh, actually run a preschool um, and have little kids come in and you're their teacher. Um, also, hopefully soon, we'll be starting off DVTV, which is another one of my classes, a daily video program you guys can watch and see what's going on around school. So we're happy to have you. I'm excited to have you, and uh, we'll see you soon. Take it easy, guys. Greetings, class of 2024. Welcome to Deer Valley High School. Let's meet your math teachers. As we start the year in distance learning, we are here to support you in your math journey and ensure that you have an exciting and successful first year here at Deer Valley High School. Hello everyone and welcome to another AUSD Tech Tip video. In today's video, student access to MyLocker, Microsoft Office, and email. In this video, I am very excited to introduce to all of our students their very own Antioch School's email accounts. and. I'll be walking you guys through your first sign in to MyLocker, an awesome site to connect you guys to important school web apps. First, let's begin by opening up your web browser. Type mylocker.anyoxschools.net in the address bar at the top. Under username, type in your school ID number. For your first time signing in, use the default password that we sent you. If you did not get a default password, call our help desk to get one. Click on sign in. Because this is your first time signing in, you need to create a new password. Type in a password that is at least 12 characters. Think of something you can easily remember like, you know, I love going to school, I love my parents or something like that. And click on submit. Since this is the first time you're signing in, you'll be greeted with a password recovery setup prompt. Click on setup recovery. Under the security tab, click on questions. You could either leave it custom or you can click on the drop down menu button and choose some pre-written questions and answers. Once you complete this section, click save. In the general tab, you can see your student info, including your new Antioch Schools email address, which is your student ID number at student.antiochschools.net. Click on save and you're in. Look for future videos that we will post to help you guys understand your MyLocker page. But for now, let's sign in to your new Office account. Open a new tab and type in office.com in the address bar. Click on sign in. Enter your student email address, which again is your student ID number at student.anyoxschools.net. Type in your new password that you created in your MyLocker site and click sign in. Click the next arrow to walk you guys through a little quick tutorial. Here on your homepage you have some very powerful tools which we will go through also in some future tutorial videos. For now I'll quickly show you guys how to view your email and help you guys to communicate with your teachers. Click on Outlook. Change the time zone to Pacific, click save. Go through some quick tutorial pages and you are ready. There you have it. Continue to log into your mylockers.anyacschools.net site to see added features. Video. Signing in to your Microsoft Teams app. 
Okay, so we're going to begin after you have logged into your mylocker.eniacschools.net site and created your own password. First, we're going to look for the Microsoft Teams icon on your desktop. If you do not see this icon, click on the Windows Start icon and type Teams. The app should appear. Click on Microsoft Teams. If the Teams app did not appear, then most likely you do not have the app downloaded to your computer. In this case, open your internet browser and type in teams.microsoft.com in the address bar, then click enter. Type in your username. For students, it should be your school ID number at student.eniacschools.net, then click on sign in. Type in the password that you created on the MyLocker website, then click on sign in. Teams will now open up to your default page with your default team selected. From here, you will see any messages that the teacher has posted to that team. Click on any other team to view the team's channel. You probably will see a different team per subject. To post a message on a team, click on the Start New Conversation text field, type your message, then click on Send. Click on Activity to see Recent Activity. Click on Assignments to look for assignments posted for each subject. Click on Calendar to see events that the teacher has posted including video chats. And click on Files to view or upload files. Click Join Team if someone has given you a code to add a team. And that's it. Signing in and a general overview of Teams. Thank you guys for watching and have a great day. Thanks everyone for watching. If you're having problems with the technology provided by us, please call Help Desk at 925-779-7676. You could email technical support at support at eniacschools.net making sure that you include your contact info. If you have any ideas for future videos, you can email them to support at eniacschools.net. Thanks again everybody and have a great day. This is Mr. Duryea in the English department with some tips on distance learning etiquette for our Deer Valley freshmen. Now that you have received your technology, your textbooks, and your schedules, you're ready to join your teachers in distance learning on the first day of school. Check your schedule to see which class you are attending first. Once you access Microsoft Teams through your MyLocker account, Find the teacher and class that you are first attending. Your Microsoft Teams classes might not populate until the first day of school. So if you're logging in early and you don't see any classes or teachers, don't worry yet. As soon as you enter the meeting, please mute your microphone. If you are called on to answer a question, you may unmute yourself. Hit the mute button again when you are finished. Do dress appropriately. Do join on time. Do mute yourself immediately. Keep your video on. Don't have distractions nearby. Refrain from chewing gum or eating food during meetings. Do pay attention. Come to the meeting prepared with questions you have about assignments or technology. You will also need to have your notebook and pencil handy. Coming prepared means keeping your technology charged so that you don't drop out of the meeting mid-class. As teachers mark their attendance, make sure to stay for the entire class period and engage with the class material as both impact your attendance. Microsoft Teams may be new software for both students and teachers alike. So be patient with yourself, your peers, and your teachers as we all get accustomed to this new format. Hello, Wolverine Nation. For those of you that don't know me, my name is Scott Allen. I teach PE and 
am the athletic director here at Deer Valley High School. Wanted to give you just a quick update um, on how this uh, 2021 20, school year is going to work out, considering all the craziness of the pandemic and all the social injustice that is happening around us at, at this time. The California Interscholastic Federation, also known as the CIF, the North Coast Section, also known as the NCS, um, govern uh, our league, the Bay Valley Athletic League, also known as the BVAL. We offer 17 different sports on campus. Um, all have been moved or pushed back into a separate uh, time schedule and frame uh, so that they can uh, hopefully, with the intention of all three groups that I mentioned earlier, um, having full seasons, complete with a full schedule of games, and including um, section playoffs, regional championships for the CIF, and uh, state championships if uh, possible for the, the state. A couple things that you really need to truly honestly be aware of is one, you have to have a physical dated after July 1st of 2020 in order to participate in athletics this school year. Um, I highly recommend and suggest that you start that process now since at this point uh, our first set of quote unquote fall sports don't start until December 14th of 2020 provided that everyone wears a mask and we can get back on campus. Once that process is completed, you're going to need to go to athleticclearance.com. At athleticclearance.com, you need to create a profile. In that profile, there's about nine sections that need to be signed by you as the student athlete and your parent or guardian, stating that you understand the risks associated with participating in athletics. Along with that, that physical should be uploaded into that profile. You can take a picture of it, send it to your computer, send it right into that profile so that it's there and ready to go. All the coaches have access to it. I have access to it. So we know that you're cleared and have been approved um, by a medical physician to participate in athletics. Now, what you also need to understand is student athlete student being the first part of that student athlete as for that you need a 2.0 of the grading period that leads into your sport since we are starting december 14th with the first round the first seven sports or so you need to understand need to make sure that you have a 2.0 grade point average that means that you should have all c's or better in those classes if at any time you need to talk to me email address is on the school website anytime you need to contact one of the coaches that you think you might want to play or participate in email addresses are on the website go to the DVHS school website under the athletic tabs, you'll see it listed as coaches. On the front page, there's some information as to when sports start, which particular sports are being played at which time this year since everything has kind of been moved around due to the pandemic. We look forward to seeing you out on the field, and we hope, forward, hope and look forward to seeing a lot of success out of you. Enjoy this 2021 crazy school year, and take care. For more online resources about district learning, go to our district website at www.antiochschools.net. Then scroll down on the front page until you see the link for distance learning. In here you'll find resources for Microsoft Teams, links for technical support, and an exhaustive guide for parents called the Parents Toolkit. Our Deer Valley High School website has some great information for parents, including the bell schedule and the link for Aries Parent Portal. Links for students.
and a tab to contact the counselors. Here you can also find information on schedule changes for the very beginning of the year. If you're on social media, you can follow us at Deer Valley High School on Facebook, as well as Wolverines DV on Instagram for informative posts as the year rolls out. As you use your Aries account to check your students' grades and attendance, you'll see that in attendance there are two designations, E for engaged or N for not engaged. This helps teachers communicate with parents on how well the students are interacting during synchronous learning times.